once we've drained out everything out of the machine, we've flushed it all out. We need to remove our drive shaft for the mixed pump up top. We're gonna to use this mixed, mixed pump shaft removal tool. Uh, everybody seems to want to grab it from this side, but there's nothing to really pry against. So you always want to use the, the longer side of this shaft as your, your pivot point. So once you do that, you can pull that out. It should slide right out. All right, now we've got it fairly clean. We're gonna wipe down the inside. Turn our wash off. Wipe everything down here. Much what our barrel should look, our hopper should look like when we're done. All right, so now that we've got everything drained out, we've wiped down the hopper. Now we can start taking the door apart. Start by taking our three draw valves out. in our bucket. We're going to take our door screws out. I was trying to do opposite diagonal corners, really pressure equally. The same when we put it back together, we want to do the same thing, opposite diagonal corners and hand tighten them. Right, we're out. Just going to set that up on the side for now. Our beater assembly, grab the blades, and our beater assembly. Take the shoes off there. And we're going to grab grab our drive shaft out of there. Sometimes you may have to use a towel to grab hold of that, get a grip on it. Star caps. Put those in as well. Right. Also going to remove these bushings for the that go inside the beater and the O-rings. All right. Then we take the rest of this over to the sink. We're going to do a hand wash with warm soapy water and then rinse off and let it air dry.